Yo guys, it's A to Z challenge and time to try out Earthshaker for the first time. I don't know almost anything about this hero. I just know that I've seen a couple of uh, pretty cool earth shattering ults that supposedly deal bonus damage on small minions. Uh, let's go check out his kit. He's a two out of three difficulty hero, but uh, should be pretty intuitive, I suppose. So we've got Fisher slammed the ground with a mighty totem, creating an impassable ridge of stone while stunning and damaging enemy units along its line. If it's impassable, then how come I can cast it? <laughs> <laughs> so that's this one, and we've seen it often. Then there's Enchant Totem, empower your totem, causing your next auto attack to do extra damage and have 75 bonus attack range. Pretty straightforward. Bonus damage is based on base damage and that given by primary attribute. I see. Self-cast with Scepter will make it behave in a non-Scepter form without jumping. I don't, don't really know what that means yet. We'll figure that out later. And then Aftershock. The Earth sh shakes underfoot, adding additional damage and stuns to nearby enemy units when Earthshaker casts any of his abilities. Pretty self-explanatory, but uh, let's check it out. So, in other words, if there's someone to the back of me and I cast the Fisher, he gets stunned, as you would imagine. And then if I put an enemy here, and I level it up. I level these up and I do a empower my auto attack. They get stunned and then I get my empowered auto attack. Pretty much. They get stunned and then I hit them for more. Yeah, it makes sense. Yeah. Here I come. <laughs> Thanks, chat. Don't tell them. Uh, okay, and then ult echo slam. Shockwave travels through the ground, damaging enemy units. Each enemy hit causes an echo to damage nearby units. Each enemy hit causes an echo. Okay. Real heroes cause two echoes. Ah, this is the one that's good against illusions, right? Like if they all have uh, Manta and they go for some uh, copies. And I cast my ult. Wow. Kazuka. The six manta juggernaut build, as we all know. Yes. Okay. And so, uh, of course, blink would be good with him. You would blink in and then cast Echo Slam. Probably blink in, BKB, Echo Slam. Okay, let's see which talents might be good. So we're getting cast range. We're getting some sustain. So I think Earthshaker, he looks like he's support, right? We don't need a lot of stats. We're a stun machine. We are a stun machine. We don't need a lot of auto attack damage or anything like that. We are support. And uh, Fisher damage. How much damage does it do? Up to 260. And base damage. So that's for last hitting. That's just my, my auto attack. That's kind of nice base damage because it interacts very happily with bonus damage. I'm going to say base damage because we're multiplying that by 400%. Aftershock damage. Aftershock damage plus 50. Uh, echo damage. Echo damage. That's echo slam. Does 110 for the echo and 180. Oh, it brings up the echo damage. The one where they hurt each other. Ah, 40. Or Fisher range. 320. Mm. I'm gonna say Fisher range. Fisher. I would I would do that even if it wasn't highlighted as it is, because it's already highlighted. Uh, Enchant totem cooldown, five to three and a half seconds, uh, or aftershock range. Aftershock. Ah, yeah, pretty obvious for his role. Okay, cool. Cool. Six million Echo Slam. I don't think EG are interested in contesting this four and five, but maybe they could delay it. Long Echo Grub. <laughs> five and five. If they Ice Blast and Fissure properly, there is uh, no hook shot. They're all together. PPD. Here comes the Ice Blast. Ready for the dive. Here from the universe. It's a disaster. CDC. They're going to get wiped from the face of the earth. Apart from aggressive. <laughs> ice Blast. Ready Wait, for the dive. This Ice Blast is Ancient Apparition, right? I played with him. They're all together. PPD, here comes the Ice Blast, ready for the dive! Here from How? Oh it's my god. CDC! They're gonna get wiped from the face of the Earth! Earth Shaker. 
Actually, actually nicer though. Base and tremble. Heck, I have to play good. Yeah. Onward. She's from the anime. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. First of all, we've got Tombstone. Enchant Totem. Yes. Imagine opening. Why would I open with Enchant Totem? I want to open with Fisher. Is Fisher mana expensive? 120. Oh, that's why. It's so expensive. I guess it helps to to last hit the the creeps. Oh yes. But if I wanted to go for first blood, mm -hmm. I'm gonna pretend to be engageable here. See? Let's roll. See, they engage me. It's a bait. It's a bait. Oh yes. No, he's low, it's fine. Mm. <laughs> what the are they doing? They're still going in. Oh my god, I can't believe this. Oh no, run! We got it, it's worth it! <laughs> it's totally worth it, Copium. Run! Pick up the gold on the way out. <laughs> Jesus. Don't block me, bro. Yeah, get the gold. It's fine. Oh my god. Move it. <laughs> Easy. Did we get this? I guess we did, right? No, we didn't. We wouldn't have got it yet, would we? Did we get two goals? Just two. Oh my god, I got all of it. Thank you. The earth moves under my feet. No, it's lucky, it's lucky. Oh my god. You're a meanie. Is it support Zeus? Yes. Ow, kind of rough without boots of speed, actually. Here I come. Base and tremble. It's hard lane, they are two ranged. Yeah. And Klinks is kind of a painful attacker. Forward. Dude, it's it's hard. We need some pool. Oh, he blocked it with a ward. That's why we can't pull. Hmm. Yeah, I'll, I'll get the magic stake. Covering ground. Yes, indeed. Nice. Stop having zero HP and AFK. I'm, I'm already getting Tango, bro. Oh, yes. The lane is too deep. I, we need the XP. We can't just let everything be denied. It's a tough lane. And he blocked the Deny. camp so we can't do pool mechanics. It's 
not going too bad when we're not literally bleeding our, our heart out. Wow, 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 wow. He slows my attack or something. I think he slows my attack. Mana is not really an issue if I'm if I'm honest with you. He's trying to Q orb walk me, right? He's threatening of that. So I can't step up. Yeah, I think I should maybe play Fisher. Even though the guide says W, because I can't do anything without it. Damage is Fisher, 110. Yes. The earth moves under my feet. Hmm. Yeah, we played Earth Spirit, it was nice. If there's a mod, can change title to uh, Earth Shaker. Magic Ring is gonna be a nice addition. Enemies, fire delivers DOT, creates a path of ice that stuns and damages. Burn enemies in an AOE with fire added to his attack while slowing. Just get the expensive one feel the earth move base and tremble ground pound the dragon is probably out somewhere getting some nice creeps Oh, they're level six already, my god. Actually, if I manned up... If I manned up, the dragon is dead. Did they? Oh, good. <laughs> Was that Zeus that killed him? Ow! Oh, sniper rotation. Alright, we need jungle for some neutrals. Time to roam and let Zeus. Oh, who's scared level 8? 
Is who scared of one that gets faster attack when he's low? Has been killed. Double damage. Hmm. Cool. So, um, there must be a chance, yes. there's a chance whether or not you get... Whether or not you get a neutral item. A 10% yes, uh, chance every time? Okay. 10% chance, got it. Oh, yes. Your middle Let's tower go. is under attack. Did I soul ring while I was getting attacked? If so, Dying quite unintentional. grief no it's good it's good actually was he stuck very nice was he actually stuck against the tree he was right <laughs> or was he afk stacked camp probably probably getting it I think I'm out okay I'm going back in I'm out, I'm out. Oops. Very good. Onward. Oh, wow. Oh my god, the gold! Earth moves under my feet. Radiant structures are Oh no! No! Kind of a disaster. Uh, Mercy? Oh, we're fast. Moving. Let's roll. Quick and crack. Zeus? Yes, Probably just playing safe. Not. Mm. Move it. 
Zeus is probably just biding his time. Let's shake things up. Yeah, he might be reading up or something. Finally, neutral item. Mana? Okay. I'll take it. Yes. I don't have Bound Turtle anymore. The enemy's bottom tower has fallen. Chant. Fisher. Let the earth quake. Your top tower is under attack. I have Facebooks now, right? Mm -hmm. Your top tower is under attack. I'm not. I need to get TP again. Yes. It's not. Ready. Oops. It's all of them. Your top tower is under attack. Dyer's structures are fortified. We still have more kills than them. Like our Huskar is still good, right? Our Marcy is good. Yeah, Huskar and Marcy are doing all right. Your top tower has fallen. The enemy's middle tower has fallen. Shake it and take it. Probably not safe actually going here. Yes. Then again, it doesn't yes. look like they're here. Oh, there's a fight. But we died. Go for the lane. Let's shake things up. Saw the fight this time, Pog. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Step one, see the fight. Forward. Step seven, join the fight when your team is fighting. I need money so yeah. my team will forgive me they know I'm gonna do great in the late game very very late yes, farming blink Okay, I'm ready, guys. Wait, did I take the wrong talent? I think I did. I'm ready, guys. <laughs> Fight over. Oh, it's because I'm on core? Oh. What is this? Oh, life steal and bonus damage. That's kind of pog. The earth moves under my feet. I guess I'll go here. 
Missing middle. Move it. Oh, it automatically interacts with the lane you're in. The middle thing. Moving. Let's roll. Let's shake things up. Looks like I haven't unlocked the laugh. Zeus is AFK mid again. Your middle tower has fallen. Forward. Yo, I got dagger. dagger. Yes, indeed. I'm not ready. Here I come. and tremble base and tremble i should be cutting through the trees your top tower is under attack secondary stats yeah i'll take that tremble. oh wait did i lock him out yeah. <laughs> With the fisher? I was just doing my routine. I pull in the other camp. Oh, they did this? Oh crap! <laughs> I blinked on the video. <laughs> I'm coming, guys. I'm coming. <laughs> I just went two v five and won. <laughs> Ward cosplay. Should've just TP? Yeah, uh, maybe. What's next? BKB? BKB takes so long. The shard? Ah, to walk on it. Did we get it though? Ow! <laughs> you blocked them all in the pit? <laughs> yeah, but I, I made sure that they can't steal our Roshan. My, uh, I couldn't blink in anymore because I took damage. You stood an enemy spell. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's basically <laughs> it's basically 100% your fault <laughs> Dyer's 
<laughs> okay, I'll take credit for it. I don't mind. Slam it. Quick and crack. I think he's dead, guys. It's a bit much, but yeah, it's a bit much to use on one person, but yeah. Hey, growth bow, uh, not for me. Your middle tower is under attack. Epic stun. Your middle tower is under attack. Is it? The earth moves under my feet. It's not ready. Down They were dead before I could have got there. Uh huh. Hmm. Always oh, not with your team. Yeah, I like split pushing. <laughs> See? It's it's lit, split pushing. You force people to react and then you just lit Don't stand in the fire, right? <laughs> then you die. <laughs> Don't clip this. Huh? Huh? <laughs> But look, I create a lot of space elsewhere. <laughs> the ground definitely looks lit. Yeah. Yeah, right underneath my feet. True. Hmm. Interesting conversation. What's the cooldown on Q? 17. Oh, yes. Aha! Now it's 16. Back to jungling. Yeah, jungling's the best. Jungling and laning. I'm coming. I'm coming. Your middle tower is under attack. Yes, indeed. Yes. Yes. Let's roll. Your middle tower is under attack. Moving. There's someone there. I was bait. <laughs> they just hit me. They just hit me. That's it. Why do I have all the wrong talents lit up?
Yeah. It doesn't matter. Position three? Oh. It's so funny, they just hit me. I couldn't blink. I kept looking at blink. Didn't do anything that team fight? Dude, I absorbed like 2,000 damage. Yes. It was like two people that were entirely focusing on me. They had to lock me down because they knew that my blink combo is too powerful. One guy was hitting me. No, the spellbreaker AoE. He did an AoE. The importance of not being seen is illustrated thusly once again. Who's Scar Gigachad? From Gigachad to Gigadad. Yeah, let's get those. But do I have space for dust? Six strength, two armor. I never use this anyway. Uh, let's see. 427. Yeah, this allows me to get my BKB pretty much. Almost. Wand? I mean, wand has been kind of good, but yeah, I'll get this now. Black King Bar. Black King Bar. I think wand is good. I, I shouldn't have sold it. It's quite useful. Buy tomes? Yeah, we do have tomes. Let's just take it. Base Nobody else control. needs it. Did I get dust here? For scouting. Covering ground. Onward. Very good. Any hey, cool neutrals? No, I'm fine with this for now. Oh, I walked through the thing so I couldn't blink in. Yes, indeed. Ceremonial is good for you? I thought it was good too. Huh? Oh, that was Dust of Appearance, not Smoke Bomb. Okay, there's no one around us, guys. I just checked. Your top tower is under attack. Your top tower is under attack. Yeah. Feel the earth move. Run, pound. Oops. That's kind of cool. Flop. That's nice. Your middle tower is under attack. 
flop into it all too. Next item, shard. We can always get there. Oh yes. Okay, we're level 18. It's up. go time. My smoke bomb. Your boss is <laughs> under attack. It's okay, I got another. Your boss in tower is under attack. Your boss in tower is under attack. Let's shake things up. Your shaman has nice. mortality. I didn't really see my Echo Slam animation. Did you guys see it? I didn't see it proc. They hit everyone, right? There was silence, but it happened. Yeah. It sounded so quiet because of the silence. should die for him right but i'm not going to okay what's next we have the shard no. oh we have shard already scepter huh mango he actually survived or did he rebuy can you see if people rebought oh he has aegis ah yeah 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 very good. That's why he plays so risky. Oh, nice illusions. Can I control those too? No. Very valuable info. Move it. Not exactly the most priority target, right? Bristle back. Oh my god. Did I do that? <laughs> I did. I'm under attack. Bye. What? I should type. Why did you guys initiate? <laughs> I baited them into a bad fight. 
Where did you go in, dudes? What is Stormcrafter? Cyclones, your hero. Passive. Huh. I forgot about the flop. Feel the earth move. Yeah, I uh, blinked in on uh, on Bristleback, their tank essentially. Your middle tower is yes, under attack. Miscuzi. Let the earth quake. Wait, Zeus has a lot of gold. <laughs> Three point two. <laughs> Zeus, I once again want to remind you about your huge pile of gold. Your 2k buff buyback. I recommend a shard. Hey, but can I just say there's a right way and a good way to rib your allies, and this is the right way? There's a lot of people that are like, can I remind you to uninstall? And that's like the wrong way? What, what does this do? And then there's the right way, which is actually to give a directive. Even if you're not expecting them to follow, but to be like, hey, this isn't ideal, can you, um... Your middle tower is under attack. Just need Blade of Alacrity, right? So I respect how, uh, how he's, how he's... Your middle tower is under attack. Is it? No. It's good. Shake it I don't think it's gonna work on Zeus. Yeah, he didn't spend. Oh yeah, I can walk over my uh, split now for one second. Oh yes. Stormcrafter takes away silence on use. Yeah. Oh, you mean the tier four neutral? That's kind of nice. You mean the one where you cyclone yourself, yeah? Feel the earth move. That's quite good. Your middle yes. tower is under attack. Don't show up in the lane so you can ambush. Yeah. Yes. I need more wards. My wards were good. The earth moves under my feet. Not ready. Onward. Nice. But I'm dying, die top. Liar. But we got bristle, that's that's true, that's a good trade. Your middle tower is under attack. Yes. Scepter Enchant Totem. Yeah. Mm. Oh yeah. Enchant. That's cool. Now I just need to remember Ogre Flop. Oh, yes. Your shard makes it so your Q gets the effect of your other ability. Move it. Yes, yes, I remember. I tested it. Forward. Oh, 
Holy crap. The tower dive guys. are under attack. I shouldn't have jumped in. I knew it. I wasn't healthy yet. I just couldn't believe they were fighting again and getting owned like that by Clinks. Ah, uh, bro. Seriously. <laughs> I didn't want to fight yet. Like, I, don't, I, I didn't wish for any of this to happen in the last five minutes. My team just got impatient. But we had them, we had them corralled into a corner, yeah? Right? And we're, we've got fishing everywhere. I just killed Sentry. I got fishing here. We could wait until we pick anybody off. And then they just push behind the bottom towers uh, alone. Now, I could, of course, be with the team. No, no, no. They're not dog shit. No, no, no. Nothing like that. I just... I like to approach these moments tactically and to to wait until the enemy overextends. Basically, if I'm with team, our strategy would be, we have superior map control, superior vision, superior jungling. We have everything, everything superior. And then we take an inferior fight under enemy towers as five. We just decide as five to jump in the bottom lane and fight under their towers. And that could work, but it is a statistically less sound approach or we play tactically, we wait till they blunder into one of our many sentry wards and observer wards. We pick the target we want to pick off and then we push in. You have to take down the tower at some point, right? If you're ahead, the enemy won't be pushing you. Yeah, but we're we getting all the jungle. Time is in their favor. They have better late game heroes. No, I had fun. Definitely. They have superior late game. You need to end faster. Maybe that makes sense too. If that's true. I wouldn't know actually. <laughs> No, maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. I'm just saying how I was thinking. Uh, do they have better late game? Clinks was scaling well. We're all uh, we're all like melee attackers or something, and then they have Clinks just absolutely murdering us from afar, essentially. I just, if I knew they were gonna go in, yeah, I would have still been there. I'm not stubborn to the degree that I wouldn't be there. 
honestly, I'm just surprised, very surprised, because I see us not committing, and then next time I look, we are behind their towers. That's what I didn't expect. But the hero feels uh, really nice. I really like Earthshaker. I'd love to play him again. Let's see what happens. Man, the replay system is so good. It's, it's insane that you can just jump in. So what happened here? Let's let's watch it from Marcy or something. Okay, so Marcy sees. Wait, how do we have vision of this, by the way? Do we have like a flare? Radiance bot. Replay bug? Oh, replay bug, okay. Bottom tower is under attack. Okay, now it's good. So it's like this, right? Uh, you have Dark Shock, which is. Who's Dark Shock? Bristleback. Huh, very pretty Bristleback. So Bristleback is here. Hey, they saw me actually enemy oh yeah i didn't know that vision yields all the way till there so anyway they know i'm top and then they've got someone mid and we have the lane pushed up in bottom lane all the way to bot and then, and then this happens but are you telling me that this makes sense that marcy goes in does she cast the ice thing Oh, it's your team's vision? Oh, yeah, 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 it's my team's vision. No, no, no. This is the... Wait. Isn't it their vision? This is their vision. Ah, but they just pinged where I was. The thing is, until this moment, right? They don't know where we are. They just do like a general safety precaution ping. Look at the map, how it is for them. Actually, let's go a little further back. This is their vision. They see... They see the four of them kind of hovering bot. I'm just looking at the minimap here. They have a 1k net worth lead, pretty small lead. We are structurally much further ahead. But now everyone's missing. Radiance bottom tower is under attack. And then suddenly he pushes up a bit, he gets attacked. And then Marcy is like, go time. Ah, that makes no sense. That makes no sense. They didn't even see me alone. I get why the rest follows up. Though I still wouldn't, personally. Not that deep. In like, what, two towers? Three towers? Two? One tower. One tower. I understand the theory, even if it doesn't make sense, you still have to go. I don't agree. I think there's plenty of ways where the opponent can throw again, if the more people you keep alive. If someone does a dive like that. Yeah. 
you lost this game, just accept it. Your team carried you so much. No, sure, sure. Like, they played fantastic. Especially Zeus, who was AFK all the time. I'm not saying I played better. I'm just looking at the late game because I want to know whether I would make the same decision again. And I would make... I could be closer, I think. I was going in with wards to try and play, like, tactically. Probably too passively. Because part of playing the game is also understanding the tendencies that people tend to have. So, for me, I would never, like, no matter how strong my hero is, I would never do that, what, what Marcy just did. I'm not saying he's bad or, like, I don't know what he was thinking, right? I'm just saying I would never do that, therefore I didn't expect anyone else to do it. This isn't about me being salty about a loss, I don't care at all about that. I'm, uh, I'm here to learn and have fun, right? I'm just thinking, did something happen that made sense? And therefore, I know beyond a doubt that I should have been there, but it didn't actually make sense. Let's say, for instance, if the enemy had a pudge, 100% I'm there. You know why? Because when the enemy hooks one of us, all of us need to pounce and go in. But they don't have a pudge. Marcy pudged herself in. <laughs> so now I understand what happened. All right, uh, Earthshaker. My thoughts on Earthshaker are that he's really fun and pretty straightforward and i would love to play it again yeah i like him he's cool 